This weekend is World Snake Day, and continuing our tradition here at the Australian Reptile Park, we're having a milk walk to see which venomous snake has the biggest venom yield. So Sam's up first, he's gonna pin the tiger snake. Um, so he's gonna start that right now. Dylan's then gonna get out a king brown uh, and pin and restrain it. And then I'm gonna get out uh, a coastal taipan. We milk Australia's most toxic land snakes to supply the raw venom that they use to make life-saving anti-venom. We milk five of Australia's most toxic terrestrial venomous snakes, king browns, eastern browns, common death adders, coastal taipans and tiger snakes. So first up is the taipan, which is a pretty decent yield. Um, that'll be probably about 150 milligrams. And we've got the king brown, which is, this is gonna be the winner. Easy 250 milligrams there. We got the eastern brown that you can barely see, but very toxic, so they only need really small yields. And we've got the tiger snake. Um, so that's actually a cracking yield from a tiger snake. That'd be like over 100 milligrams, really decent yield. And then we've got the death adder, and we've probably got 40 milligrams there, I'd say. Um, so not massive, but again, very toxic. This Sunday, the 16th of July, come to the Australian Reptile Park, our one o'clock deadly and dangerous show. Myself and Keeper Dylan are gonna do a milk off down in the show pit. Don't miss out.